Hey guys, does this look familiar? We're on site of the end right now exploring a ton of new relationships. And if you want to do the same and explore the relationships in your life, you should go to theskindeep.com slash shop and check out our card game. Thanks. How has our relationship changed since we first came on the end? That was like forever ago. We were like newlyweds when we did our first one. Yeah. What were we like married like three months? Something like that? Not even, Barely. I think. Barely? I think we've just gotten married. Oh my gosh. So we've, we've, we've hit that point where we've been a, couple, a married couple longer than we were a dating couple. So most of our I relationship has been- I thought about that. Yeah, most of our relationship has been us being married. Ugh. Um, I think we've changed a lot since we got married. Yeah, no. I think we've just gotten I like- think we're, I think we're as silly as we were when we got married. We, we definitely still have as much fun as we, as we used to. I don't think we've lost that, but I think we've gotten, I think we've got a better grip on how, you, you know, how we handle things and how we approach things in, in um, how we lay out our plans for the future. Like sometimes we know what is best for each other. And I think that's one of the big differences over the last few years is we've started to listen to each other more. And trust that. Yeah. That like, you know, as a big decision comes, I'm thinking, what would Andrew say? You're always in my head. I feel like I get to have two people up in here some days. I'm, I love you. I love you a bunch. You know, in five years, I think we made each other better people. I agree. And I take better care of myself. You do. So much better care. You. This is the healthiest I've seen you the whole time we've been, since we started dating eight years ago. Wow. This is the healthiest I've seen you. you your, so your hospital scare was about two years ago this week. You haven't been back to the hospital since. It means a lot. Uh, what's one thing I can do to improve our relationship? The easiest thing you can do to improve your relationship, our, our relationship. relationship. The way you can improve our relationship, first of all, not correcting me. <laughs> Secondly, um, I think taking better care of your needs. You put your needs second too often or third or fourth. I don't know if it's fear that you don't go over after the things you love. I don't know if it's like self-worth. I don't know what it is, but I was like, prioritize your needs. I support you. I'm here for you. That's a, that's, that's a, it's hard for me. I know, we've been together eight years and it's always been the thing where I'm like, that's great, prioritize yourself. I mean, I, I am. I did, I quit my job and came out here. And yeah, and my reaction to that is more. You know that though. I can, okay. Okay. Wait, is it, yeah, I think you're right, it's you. Ugh, greedy. I'm prioritizing my needs, oh, okay. okay. Shut up. <laughs> Oh, what have you recently learned about me? I think I've learned, I think it's a thing that we both learned about you and that's being out here in the fall and being out here for a month or two on your own. As hard as it was, I think it was good for you to kind of, like, like you said, like you set up the apartment and like you had to do all of these things on your own while I was taking care of Johnny back home. But you did it. Those are things that I don't know if you knew that you could do on your own until you did them. I feel like I know it. I just don't want to. But you haven't done them. And now that you did them, you, you have a level of confidence about yourself and just like the way you carry yourself in this town that I wasn't expecting when I got off the plane. I think that's part of what surprised me about here. But like also because I'm originally from California, it's a very weird being like, oh, Oh yeah, this is who I've always been. Yeah, it's a bit of a return to form for you. Like, had we come here together, yeah, we would have. Things would have been great. We would have been fine. We would have done our thing. But you having to do this on your own for a few months, I think, 
gave you the opportunity to own your place in the city on your own without me. You didn't need me to define what your role in the city is. Shut up. <laughs> did, I, did I touch a nerve? Yeah. It's cool to see. You always impress me and surprise me. Now take up space. <laughs> What's one thing you want us to experience together and why? Oh, one thing y us to experience together? Oh, one? Shit. Uh, <laughs> if you got more, bring them. I'm, I'm, I'm no, always. I'm trying to, I was like, oh. Don't I, say parenthood, because that's, we're going to, we'll, we'll do that. Shut up. I'm talking. <laughs> I can't wait to get to like 60, our kid is out, and we can just be horny, like lecherous <laughs> bastards around the world. It's not too different from now, we just don't have the kid yet. Yeah, but like once they're like out, it's like, all right, your room's a sex swing. <laughs> <laughs> and then we can get the sex swing? Maybe. Uh, we'll see. We're pretty horny and lecherous as it is. Oh, there. Oh, that little... we've, got, we've almost gotten into trouble. <laughs> My turn, your turn. Uh, why do you think I'm in your life? Oh. Why do I think you're in my life? Mm -hmm. Comedy. We have a love of laughing and comedy. On paper, there's no reason we should have gotten together. No. Like, the timing was right. Like, I had eyes for your roommate. I was married. Well, separ like divorcing. Se separated. I was separated. I, like, and then when it happened, it was, and I was just like, oh, Andrew's fun. I just want to make out with him. That, I know. Here we are. Yeah, I know. All, it all started because I was like, uh, I've had a couple of drinks. I just want to make out. And holy shit. Yeah, I wanted to do a lot more than make out. Obviously. <laughs> Am I still fun to make out with? Great. Cool. And I tell everybody you're the longest hookup of my life. Yeah. At no point did it ever feel like either of us were desperate to, like, ugh. And that this has just been a fun, joyful adventure. I think that's what it's it is. a good foundation. I feel like yeah. we're on a journey together. And that's what makes everything okay and not scary. Or it feels like we're always like, what's the next thing? What's the next piece of this journey? What would your life be like without me? Can I tell you one of my biggest fears? Uh, and it's, it's, I've had nightmares about it. I think I've told you about some of these, but like a recurring fear of mine is that like one day uh, we'll wake up and you just won't want to be married to me anymore. No, maybe. I, you, know, I, you know, it's, so I, I don't know what my life would be like without you, but I, I, do, f I do fear one day that you would kind of get over me and want to move on. And I don't know what I'll do, but it won't be good. It'll be kind of sad. Well, I'm here. I know. And I love you. And you know, I will always love you. I know. I know that, I know that up here, I just sometimes fear it. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if my life without you will be, be a lot less laughing. I think I, I would, I'd be really sad and lonely. I guess I gotta stay here then. Yeah, that's why I'm glad you're taking care of yourself. I love you.
I love you a bunch. Nerd. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I had to turn off my voice inside that wanted to say what my impulse wanted to say. What shitty thing did you want to say? Uh, we done? Because we want to bang. Uh, <laughs> that's... <laughs> but I, like, silenced it for a minute, but then I was like, I don't know, it's funny. Um, I had that thought a few questions ago, and I was like, mm, that's not appropriate. But, but I you said, said it. it. Yeah, you know me. I'll say it. All right, we done because we're gonna bang. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you. Hey guys, thanks for sticking with us. Be sure to subscribe if you want to stay up to date with the most recent releases. And if you want to check out the end card game, go to theskindy.com/shop to start connecting more with the people you love. Thanks. <laughs>